everybody, welcome back. I got another video of me trying shit out. Um, I saw somewhere online that there is a dupe for that expensive ass Dyson. I'll put the price somewhere on the screen. And I don't have $600, so I bought the dupe for $40 on Amazon. I just washed and conditioned my hair, and I wanna show you guys how I use this and if it works, if it's a dupe or if it's a dub. I use this As I Am Twist Defining Cream, wash and go, which is essentially what I have going on with my hair right now and of course I put a little bit of gel because I like to mix these two together just to define the curls it's a wash and go I'm going out tonight so I just wanted to have something when I don't know what to do with it see so all right so this is what the box looks like um it is definitely the same color the same color as the Dyson and it comes with a couple pieces so it comes with your traditional like which one? Somebody comment down below what this one is called, but I think this is a regular one just to blow dry the hair. And then there is another piece in there that's similar like it. And then we have the diffuser. And then we've got the blow dryer. This sucker, I hope it works. Um, it's very nice, it's very sleek. It has a cooling option, which is one of the reasons that I bought it. And then it has the two or three settings. So let's plug this bad boy in and blow dry this hair. Okay. Okay, so you just lock it in. So, first level, second level, or one level? So, I'm gonna be hot. Guys, this is where it's at. Like honestly, the last blow dryer that I had did not, and a quality check pass to, I don't know, this is really like, my hair is, so my hair is low porosity, it's very thin, it's a lot of hair, but it's thin, and then I have four C, four, four Z, like zebra. It is so tightly curled, so it's very hard for me to like really love my hair sometimes because it's such a challenge, and I know that there's videos out there like, no, you can figure it out, but honestly, when you've had hair issues as long as I have, honestly, it's, it's, it's a, it's a love hate. It's kind of picking out my hair, and then I will finish drying and then we will give the final thoughts on his dupe. Honestly guys, you need it. I am in love with how quickly, so it's been a little less than 10 minutes that I have been blow drying my hair. Obviously I've sped up a lot of things. Um, my hair looks really good. I do really like the products that I use so that I can like keep the curls and I feel like they're like more defined and like I have a love-hate relationship with my fro. Some days I like it, some days I'm like I could go bald at any second. But um, that's just hair. I feel like every woman feels that way about their hair. 
I feel like this is such a good ass blow dryer. I think the arena of is it a dupe for Dyson probably shouldn't happen on this video just because I don't have a Dyson. I honestly cannot afford a Dyson with the life I live. A blow dryer and you want something that is cute because you know girl, your girl loves pink. Um, it is loud. I don't know if people care about stuff like that because I recently this past weekend went to Sally's and Sally's has so many good blow dryers this lady was showing me all of them but I wasn't really in the market to spend like 80 90 to 100 dollars I get it usually when you spend more money it is technically supposed to equate to quality depending on where you're buying that, that goes for anything right like a purse from marshall's is not going to cost the same thing as a purse from louis vuitton it's the quality says so i get it i feel like this is a quality quality dupe even though i've never actually tried it on my hair i have seen the dyson blow dryer um at my old sephora stores when i used to work there and they honestly are amazing they had amazing sales i've seen all the reviews and i'm like i've always wanted one of those but your girl chose this dupe what i really like about it is that it comes with this diffuser i've never had a blow dryer like kit come with that and i think these little two things if i did have long hair would be pretty dope i love that it comes in cool And that it's actually cooling. You know, I think that when you get through blow drying your hair, it should be, um, I think you should work it up. I feel like me, in my personal opinion, what works best for me is medium heat, then you get to the high heat, and then when you want to finish it, when it's about 90% dry, I think you should do cool. That's my personal preference, just so that you can minimize heat damage. But I also really love this little concoction I did because it definitely helped with the diffusing process when I use this. But honestly, this is a really, really good blow dryer. The reviews on Amazon have like thousands of reviews, and they're like, some people feel like it's a good dupe, some people feel like it's not, some people feel that. It's just a really good blow dryer on its own. You can be the deciding factor for that. I'm going to link the blow dryer down below and um, that's the end of my video. So thank you guys so much for watching my channel. A shout out to everybody who made me fucking go viral on TikTok this past week. It's been so awesome. I have been producing more content on there. So if you want to follow me, that's all my information. I do do Instagram because honestly, Instagram is my favorite social media app, but YouTube will always have a special place in my heart. And uh, I love every single one of you guys. Thank you so much for watching my channel. I'll see you next time.